In this video, I'll show you how you can fix unable to authenticate Epic Games services in GTA 5. So the first step you must take is to actually go to your search bar on PC and type Epic Games Launcher. Now the next step is to open the launcher where you have installed GTA 5. For me, it's Rockstar Games Launcher. And make sure that you're locked in here as well. Now I currently do not have GTA 5 installed, but I'll show you how it basically works. So let's pretend this is GTA 5. Click on the three dots, go to manage and go and click on create desktop shortcut and try and launch the game through the shortcut that you have created. The next way is to go to your PC, go to local disk, go to program files, go to Rockstar Games, click on social club and copy socialclub.dll. Then go to your launcher where you installed GTA 5. Now in this case, it's my Rockstar launcher. I go to settings, I click on GTA 5, I click on view installation folder and I'm going to copy paste it in this GTA 5 enhanced folder. And then I'm going to launch GTA 5 through the Rockstar launcher. Now the next step will be to sign out from the launcher and to also sign out from Epic Games. And once you signed out from both these platforms, what you should do then is go to view network connections and you should then right click and disable your internet connection. And once you have done that, you're gonna have to sign in on offline mode. So like you can see we have disabled our Wi-Fi so what we're gonna do is we're gonna click on go offline so I'm gonna show you an example if we launch a game this is what it will show connection error launcher is running in offline mode some games are dependent on the connection press on ok and then try and enable your connection again and launch the game now the next method will be to go to PC and type services go to epic online services right click on it go to properties make sure that the startup type is set to automatic and then click on start like so and then press apply and click on OK.